Hello friends, I haven't uploaded the tutorial here for a long time, sorry if I have never updated again. To start earlier this year, I will share the Inkscape tutorial, which is creating a slash text effect. Here I am inspired by the Adobe Illustrator tutorial and then I adapt it in Inkscape. Okay. The following is the final design result, like this. Let's open Inkscape. Okay, here I create a letter. Here I use the letter S. With the font type um, Fredo Kawan. Click this key icon and for width, fill with number 200 pixels. Here I give um blue color. And then change this text object to pet. Pet, object to pet and ungroup. Object, ungroup. Okay. And then we will modify this letter manually. Okay. Here I create um ellipse object like this. Yeah. And then you know, um here I give a pink color. Convert this object to pet. Okay. Here I did this handle handle note. Yeah. Okay, rotate this. I'm sorry. Rotate this ellipse object like this. And then duplicate this ellipse and drag it to this side. Okay. Duplicate, drag, Okay, duplicate this ellipse and here I try for this center of object like this. Here I give a pink um yellow color. Okay, right click the pink object, select same fill color. Mm, sorry. Duplicate. 
duplicate and drag like this give a yellow color I, I rotate okay okay right click the pink object and select sim fill color and then union pet union and then duplicate and then select with a uh, blue object like this click pet and then choose division okay you can select this object and delete 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 and delete okay you you can give a pink object change the change this pink object to blue object okay in order for the slice effect to blend with the text we create a path around the end of this ellipse I mean like this in here okay you can use um, Bezier curve and then draw like this yeah object like this and then duplicate this ellipse and drag it to this side okay duplicate try Okay, duplicate this ellipse and here I drag for this center of object like this here I give a pink um, yellow color okay right click the pink object okay right click uh, blue object and then select sim fill color and then union pet union Okay, you can edit this um, yellow object. Resize like this. Here I create um, like whole object like this. Okay. To 
duplicate and then resize hmm, sorry give a yellow color I, I wrote it okay okay right click the pink object and select sim fill color and then union path union and then duplicate and then select with uh, blue object like this click path and then choose division okay you can select this object and delete 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 and delete okay you you can give a pink object change the change this pink object to blue object okay okay right click um yellow object click right click select same fill color and then union path union and then select with um, blue object like this and then click path difference okay and then we create an object for the splice effect you can use the bezier tool splice effect like this like uh, water drop okay you can use um bezier curve and then draw like this in here okay you can use um, bezier curve and then draw like this like this Okay, and then we unit all object. Select all of object, path, union, and then you can give a gradient color. Click a gradient tool. Sorry. Open fill and stroke, and click linear gradient like this click gradient tool for this point here i give um pink color like this and for this point we give um purple color okay and then rotate like this yeah 
finally we can create a slash text effect in Inkscape. What do you think? Is it is it? I think it's enough for this tutorial. If there is something missing or wrong, please submit in the it in the comments column below. Thanks for watching and see you again in the next video.